interesting thing about it is that the, the company that is doing that is it's like a supermarket chain. These sort of changes make more sense somehow if they just get used by more people. Do you know what ingredients you're using? I don't know, actually. You're just trusting yeah. the, the supermarket? Yeah, it, it says it's a ecological soap. Let's see, the list is ingredients. I mean, it's in Spanish, but methyl chlorosylonium. Well, there is another way to read that. Huh? Oh, they have info here. Info at detergent.com. Let's see. Hmm. It doesn't smell that chemically. Info detergent.com. Barcode. Basically, you put in the barcode and it like tells you all, it lists all the ingredients. Does it work? Yeah. The problem is then you have to know what these ingredients are, like ethanol, alcohol, sodium laureth sulfate, which actually is a sulfactant, which can be an irritant, a bit of an irritant, but it's like, it's what seventh generation and the major labels, the green labels in the U.S. use. And then there's this methyl chloro, this long thing, I think I have to look that up. There's a Wikipedia entry and it says that it's basically a preservative with antibacterial and antifungal effects. But it says it used to be in cosmetics and it's kind of been removed from that because it can be like an allergen in high doses and stuff, but that's different. So, but it basically says that the International Agency for Research on Cancer does not list methyl chloro, la la la, as a known probable or possible human carcinogen. So it's basically just like it couldn't be an allergen, but... The thing is that even green products have these sort of ingredients. Yeah. You have to look for in the internet or whatever before the internet was not even possible to do that because only scientists uh, working for companies would have access to the whole study and knowledge yeah. You know, yeah. to, to decipher what the studies were because there was no Wikipedia. Mm. I wonder if it makes more sense to make your own soap. With just what? With what? Uh, I mean, you could, you could just ask your grandparents. Yeah, it is true. If I go back here, it has two colorants in it. Take out all these stuff yeah. and, and, the, and the preservation of the product. Take out the, all these stuff and make something fresh that can clean your house. Yeah. At least it was cheap. It was only like a dollar fifty or a euro fifty compared to the other one. There's other stuff that was double the price.